Ladies and gentlemen, this is your host here. It is Team Right Right. Listeners, how in the hell are you doing on this Sunday's edition? I am doing very well for myself. It's a crappy day outside. No sunshine at all. That sucks. But let's cut to the chase. I will discuss for you my lovely listeners wrestling news wrestling topics and a lot of interesting topics to discuss for you yes for you so if you like sit back relax be your feet up grab something to eat grab something to drink now if you don't want to do nothing at all maybe you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts and opinions on this certain matter and there will be an article down below let's freaking roll this shall we now from this report once again Samoa Joe is injured Jesus crying aloud this guy recently had a very decent feud Decent push against AJ Styles for his WWE Championship. And of course, that feud is over with. And now, Samoa Joe is injured. That really sucks. This guy is very injury prone, in my opinion. Okay. Now, I know this is, what, a few days old with this report. So what? I'm still going to get my thoughts on the freaking matter. So if you like it, stick with it. If you hate it, then you can just not listen to it until later on tonight. But anywho, Dave Milzer, whatever his freaking last name is, reports in the latest edition of the Wrestling Observer Newsletter that Samoa Joe is currently out of action with another injury. No duh. There no word yet on the details of the undersclosed injury. Wow, that really sucks. Okay, if you recall, Joe was set to challenge the champion AJ Styles at the Super Showdown Live event just last weekend, but did not work those shows. Since working his last match back on October Ninth, wow. In an episode of SmackDown Live against Jeff Hardy, he hasn't been clear to compete. Oh my lord. I didn't pay attention. I didn't know he was injured. That really sucks. Now I'm assuming whenever he comes back, hopefully he's not out for the rest of the year like Sami Zayn and other WWE superstars. Like um, Kevin Owens, you know? That really sucks. So whenever he comes back, I'm assuming that W is gonna put him bottom of the totem pole. He's not gonna get that kind of push once he comes back. That's just my theory. Probably W says you're injured, you mean on the back burner, and then W is gonna push someone else. And that really sucks, you know? I think, in my opinion, this guy deserves a freaking W title belt around his freaking waist. I know he had a title opportunity. He should beat freaking AJ Styles. AJ Styles had a belt since last November and it was time for my opinion <clears throat> my opinion my opinion only to have AJ Styles lose to Small Joe but I guess they found out that he's injured so they let AJ Styles keep holding a belt. Maybe he's gonna keep it until next month when you're he since he had that belt. You know, I like AJ Styles, but I think it's time for a change, you know? Probably a lot of you prefer AJ Styles over Smojo any day of the week. So I'll keep you guys updated once I hear another report. So that really sucks about Samoa Joe. Now off the record tonight for the first time ever in WWE history, we're going to have an all-women pay-per-view called Evolution. Are you looking forward to the card tonight or not? Hopefully, it's not going to be a letdown. 
Yesterday sometime, I discussed about Miss Bliss have been pulled away from the event because due to concussion, her replacement is Mrs. Alicia Fox. Really? Her? Why her? I don't understand. You know, I know she's on the w Raw TV for quite some time now. She's a veteran. I prefer having, I know, I mentioned it yesterday. If you missed out, I want to say it again. Have Lita versus Trish. A good old rivalry matchup, okay? That's just my opinion, you know? And then Mickey James could have her own match or whatever, but that's just my opinion. I know my opinion does not matter on social media. I prefer that than having Miss Alicia Fox in this tag team match. Or have her in a battle royal. If she wins that, and then she automatically gets... She is a one number one contender. But we all know that she's not going to be there. She's not going to be in that position anyway if she wins it. I mean, she does not win it. You know what I'm trying to say? Just put her in there just for the hell of it. They should just scrap the tag team match and have um, Lita versus uh, Trish. Good old one on one match. Great rivalry, you know? But they won't do that because they've been hyping this tag team match for a long time. Now, instead of Miss Bliss, it's going to be Alicia Fox, her replacement. What's your thoughts on that? What's your thoughts on the article? I want some positive feedback about the article. Positive feedback, what I had to say about tonight, Evolution. Is anyone going to watch it tonight? Is anyone going to attend it live in living color? Have a good one. Take care. And spike that hair of yours. This is your lovely host there. It is Team RA. Ciao for now.